I had some scares in the past where they would find something on my mammogram, but thank God nothing was there. So then this time I did not feel a lump or anything. I got my mammogram. It did show there was something there and they wanted to do biopsies. Um, so I went in and got my biopsy done. And I knew when I answered the phone, it's probably not good news. So, um, you know, they told me that, you know, you do have cancer. We have to do more testing and, and biopsy it and all this. I was like, oh my goodness, I can't do a lot. You know, can I get through this? I was, you know, cause I had a lot of stuff going on in my life before my son had passed in 22 when I found out I had cancer. And so it was just too much. <laughs> yeah, it was a lot to take in, I'll say it that way. I kept praying the whole time that I'm gonna get through this, and you know, and, and everything. And it was weird because, sorry if I cry. It was weird because um, right when I went into surgery, I said a prayer and I said, God, hold this hand. And then I asked my son to hold this hand. And I know that's why I'm here. They answered my prayers. See, now that my chemo is over, I feel like I should go back to being normal and I can't because I get too tired. You know, I try to do things and then I need a nap. <laughs> Oh, I was just so excited when I came in, I came in shopping and Deb was so, she's been so nice. She told me about the fashion show and asked if I liked to be in it. I said, oh, that sounds like fun. I just think it's cool to get up there and let people see you and know that, you know, anyone can do this. You can get through it. It's tough, but you can get through it.